So anyway, we have a... Uh, Thanks, great, Mr. Richter. Uh, you're welcome. Thank we have a great you show tonight. Well, we're going to have... Uh, there we go. We're going to have an Andy. There you go. Andy. You're coming. Andy. Yeah. What's going on? Oh, uh, I'm sorry, Conan. It's, I just got a lot of fans down here at Comic-Con. They're always... They're always, they're always asking me to sign my comic books. Wait a minute, sign your comic books? Whoa, you have comic books? Yeah, I've published my own comic book for uh, quite a while now. It's, it's very popular. I mean, look. <laughs> what are you talking about? I didn't know you even had a comic book. Well, sure I did. Here, take a look at this. For the past, I don't know, uh, 24 years and 10 months or so, I've been inspired to write and produce my own comic book series, Red Dingus. <laughs> and, you know, I didn't want him to be your traditional likable or manly or even good superhero. That would be too predictable. Red Dingus, well, he's the friggin' worst. <laughs> that hasn't hurt sales, though. People love to hate this guy. This is the issue where the Red Dingus' desperate need for attention and approval is so great it creates a literal black hole. <laughs> now check it out. Ooh, I never got what I needed when I was young. <laughs> this is the moment in issue 113 where Red Dingus does his patented hip handle dance for the people of planet Exor, who see it as an act of war. Thousands die. Well, this is the first time we see the Red Dingus' stupid space cruiser. <laughs> You can see such hot crap when he's behind that thing. This is like an early sketch where we learn of the Red Dingus' origin story. See, he was uh, bitten by a poisonous tick, and uh, that, that sapped him of all his pigment and testosterone and, and gave him a stupid, deformed haircut. <laughs> he's so gross. Oh, yeah, this is, uh, this is the Red Dingus' incredibly competent sidekick, Handsome Andrew. Yeah, he uh, usually fixes all the Red Dingus' messes and then he doesn't get any credit for it. Check out that package. <laughs> I just really wanted to create a true intergalactic jackass, a universal annoyance that alienates all species. I get asked all the time, Andy, where'd you come up with this idea? I mean, what's the inspiration for Red Dingus? And I guess my answer is, I don't know. You want, want me to sign a copy for you? I'm, I'm good. I'm really good. Uh, here, I'll, I'll, I'll give it to you after the show. Great. Yeah, <laughs> terrific. All right. C-O-N-A-N. That's right? okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> That's all. That's all. And you say sales are good. Oh, they're fantastic. <laughs>